Glad to see I wasn't forgotten. How could we? Your last day of duty was etched painfully into everyone's memory. I know. It's the same for me. Some of us didn't think you'd come back after the accident. I mean, that was quite a story. Nah, I've only just started here. I'm not quitting my job that easily. Sounds like you've already made plans. Are you planning to catch the racers yourself? You mean you haven't caught them yet? I'm afraid not. I'm sorry I don't have better news for you. These guys always seem to be one step ahead of us. If that's the case, why are we still hanging around here? Well, that's what I call a proper work ethic. Put on your uniform and come and see the governor. Glad you're back. We really missed you, you know. But let's have a chat later. I suppose you've got lots of stuff to sort out. I will. See you later. Hi, Jess. Anything up? Well, nothing much going on right now. Then I'll drop in some other time, OK? Good morning, Governor. Ah, there you are. Welcome back. Did you have a good time recovering? I am back in shape again. Just took a while, unfortunately. However, I would feel even better if you'd let me take this case. I want to put a stop to the races. I certainly understand that, but I can't allow it. I beg you! They almost killed me in one of their competitions. They stop at nothing and nobody. That is exactly the point. You don't have enough experience yet to take on these people. I have to agree with the governor on this one. They're a whole gang of criminals. With your current rank, you wouldn't stand a chance, even if today wasn't your first day. So, what can I do on my first day, then? I got a stolen vehicle report. That would be a good place to start. Will you take the case? Okay. Let's make sure that the owner gets his vehicle back. Who am I working with? Hasn't anyone told you yet? You two will be working together from now on. Um, okay. And what about... Oh, come on. I'm not that unbearable. Let's go. Okay, then. Do we just shoot off, or is there anything else I have to be briefed on? Of course there is. And I never just shoot off. Well, then it's a good thing I'm going to drive. I am allowed to, aren't I? For now. As long as you stick to the highway code. Okay. All right, then, moving on. We know what type of vehicle it is, but the registration number has most likely been swapped. This means we'll have to check all vehicles of the same make and model. So, a classic traffic check? In a way. After all, we are looking for a specific car, but that doesn't stop us from reporting other defects. Understood. I'm driving. Hey, partner. This is not a good time, actually. Let's talk about that later.
So, what's been going on while I've been away? How come you are my partner now? There have been no major arrests or spectacular cases recently, and, well, you'll have to ask Becca why he put the two of us together. Just make sure you don't sound too enthusiastic. Otherwise, people might think that you would much rather have a partner with more experience. Come on, I just have to spend some time getting used to you. And already we have something in common. If it continues like this... Yes, we're sure to become besties. Yeah, right. Now concentrate, we have to find the stolen car. Okay, let's take a look around. The vehicle we're looking for should be here somewhere. How about that blue one there? That fits the description we were given. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Why did you stop me? I've stopped you for a check. Please show me your license and registration. Everything looks fine. I will check your vehicle and the boot. Please wait a moment. This almost completes the check. Do you agree to a breathalyzer test? Of course, no problem.
Everything is fine. You really have not been drinking. You will receive a fine for the violations. That was obviously not a success. What do we do now? Keep driving. The vehicle we're looking for has to be somewhere. Calling all cars. The stolen car has been sighted. That must be ours. We'll get him. Foxtrot 1, can you get us a position where the car was last sighted? Here you go. But you have to hurry if you want to catch up with him. Understood. Put your foot down. Oh. Now I may? Yes, you may. Get a move on. someone else. Foxtrot 1 to dispatch. This is dispatch. We've got the car thief and the stolen car. We're bringing him in, but the car will have to be towed away. Understood. Take care of it. Thank you. See you soon. Well, not too bad for your first day. That almost sounded like a compliment. Because it was one. You stopped the stolen vehicle almost professionally. So, still only almost. There's always room for improvement. If you say so. Let's take our new friend to the station.
Feels good to have made the streets safer, doesn't it? Absolutely. That's why it's so good to be back at last. Even though you now have me as a partner. Maybe it's good to have someone by your side who's a stickler for the rules. Rules are important. They're there for a reason. And you know them all by heart. Precisely. So, what's the next step? Well, now we go on patrol or we pick a particular assignment. In any case, there's always enough to do. Hey, partner. What is it? I thought we could indulge in the little small talk. That's nice for you. I'll be getting back to work then. So, what's new? Nothing right now. It's fairly quiet at the moment. Next time, maybe. Anything exciting been happening? Nothing much has been happening, really. Well, then, see you. So, what's going on? At the moment, I have no particular jobs for you. OK. See you later. Calling Foxtrot 1. Foxtrot 1? A report has come in about animals running loose on the motorway. Understood. We'll head over there and check.
calling Foxtrot 1. Foxtrot 1? I have more detailed information for you now. According to the caller, a herd of cows is causing chaos. It looks like there are quite a few of them. Understood. My boot. What are you doing? You can't cheese. Watch out. That's just some woman driving way below motorway speed. I was going to say that. Foxtrot 1. The case has just become more urgent. The animals have caused an accident. How many people are involved? Unknown. How far away are you? We're almost there. We'll get back to you. We have arrived. Let's get to work. Easy for you to say. What are we going to do with the animals? Let's just make sure we don't provoke them. The best thing to do is to secure the accident scene first. Oh, yes. That'll definitely stop the cows. Very funny. I'll find out who the animals belong to, and you can question the people involved in the accident. I'll join you in a minute. And be careful, animals are unpredictable. Will do.
Well, what do we have here? I'll take that as evidence. Hello. Can I ask you a few questions? Of course. It's good that you're finally here. What happened here? This fellow here happened. It's a miracle that no one was seriously injured. I couldn't agree more. Did you manage to observe anything else? Like how that fellow was talking on the phone? Because that's what he was doing. He wasn't concentrating on his driving at all. Did you see how the accident happened? No, unfortunately not. I only heard the crash shortly after this fellow overtook me, and then there were suddenly cows all around me. We will find out exactly what happened. Don't worry. Thank you for your assistance. Hello. Mr. Weiss, right? Can you tell me exactly what happened? You bet I can. Well, I'm, I'm rushing to an important meeting, and suddenly this creature is standing in front of me. So... You crashed because of the cows? How exactly did that happen? <laughs> well, how do you think? The stupid cow was standing there in front of me. I was scared to death and yanked the steering wheel around. Cows don't just suddenly appear out of nowhere. We'll ask you a few questions and then we're sure to learn more. The witness noticed that you were using your mobile phone while driving. Is that why you did not see the animals? Rubbish! That's not true! And what might this be? Where did you get that from? It was lying there in the road. Were you perhaps on the phone while driving after all? Definitely not. It must have been thrown out of the car during the accident. And will your call list back that up? Listen, if we trace a call to the time of the accident, you're in deep trouble. It would be wise for you to cooperate with us. That could help reduce your sentence. Okay, so I was on the phone. But still, these cows are to blame for the accident. Well, the fact is, you can look forward to a pretty hefty fine. And as a bonus, you'll be getting a point or two on your driving record. The fence is broken. No wonder the cows ran onto the road. There was nothing to stop them. The animals belong to a certain Janina Neudorf. The station has contacted her. She should be here shortly. All right. And what do we do with the cows in the meantime? We send them back where they came from. Sure, because such a huge cow will definitely listen to us. You're not supposed to ask them. You're supposed to shoo them. But maybe it'll help if you flatter them. You have such a beautiful voice. They'll listen to you for sure. I don't remember reading this in the job description.
Do you want to get rid of me? Hush! Push! Mrs. Newdorf, we've been waiting for you. Can you please explain us why your cows were walking across the motorway? Oh, dear God, this can't be true. How did that happen? The cows must have escaped through the damaged fence. One of the boards is broken. Who is in charge of the maintenance of the fence? Um, me. It's my fault. I just didn't get round to checking everything. I must have overlooked the fact that the fence is broken. I'm sorry, especially for the drivers. What happens now? You'll be invited to the police station in the next few days. They'll tell you what to do. Well, uh, thanks for your help anyway. Who knows where the cows would have gone otherwise? Nuh uh, not like that. I need a broom. Was anyone hurt? There was an accident caused by... well... Cows. Precisely, cows. One driver was unable to brake in time and lost control of his vehicle. His car rolled over and he is injured. But the cows are fine? They're probably all in a state of severe shock. But apart from that, they're fine. Okay. 
Then we'll see to the injured. We've got it. 